What is going on guys? Jack here and welcome back to day 5 of the Advent Calendar Challenge. We're back again. It's episode 5, the Box of Destiny. It's here. Hopefully it can be kind to us. The last few days, you know, we've not had the best letters. I'm hoping today it's going to be a little kinder to us as I do pick out a letter. And today, it's going to be the letter H. Good letter. I think we can work with that. Hopefully the will can be kind to us. And, uh, well, maybe we can get a little bit more than a million pounds to spend today. Okay, folks, the wheel, it's back, of course. Well, I mean, I, I say this every day. It, it's its not run away. It is still here. Let's give it a spin. Wheel, be kind to me. Do not let me down today. Give me some big money. <sighs> okay, that is the fourth lowest total on the board. We have £25,000 to spend. The letter today is the letter H. It's not very good. It's... There's... Let's get in game. Let's get in game. Okay, guys, so here we are back at Santa Claus FC, of course. And uh, yesterday, we picked up, if we look here, well, we've got his nickname now, but his original name was Re Reinhold Yabo. He's now known as Reindeer Yo-Ho-Ho-Ho. -Ho -Ho. Pretty good. I think we'll just call him the deer for sure. You know, he's going to be ramming people down and doing... I mean, what do reindeers do? Graze and ram things. That I, that, that will go... He, he's, the, he's our enforcer in the midfield. Don't know where I'm going with this. Let's have a look at the players that we can look at to sign today. So, of course, the letter is H. I can't actually set, select 25,000 in these filters. So, we'll go with 26,000, of course. That dis discount a few at the top. But, well, we have the option of any of the players from here downwards, of course. Last name beginning with the letter H. I've got to be honest, the player from Gibraltar is catching my eye. Of course, I do have an, a bit of an affinity to little old Gibraltar. But he is a goalkeeper. We don't really need one. There's Gavin Hoyt here who is a Eastleigh player. Now, we could do with a centre-back. He's not exactly a great centre-back, the Trinidad... Trinidad... What do you call someone from Trinidad and Tobago? Apparently, it's Trimbongu... Trin... Why am I struggling with that so much? Send help. It's been the end of a long day. You might notice. And if I look pretty rough today, I've just come in from work. I've been working all day. I want to get this video up before another upload later on tonight at 9pm. Um... We won't go with him because I can't say the, what the nationality of someone from Trinidad and Tobago is. I did notice this guy, Hawkson, at the top. He's a winger. I mean, he caught my eye because he was Icelandic, but he's not going to be much use to us. We could go with someone like Marcus Haber here, or Haber. Canadian. I mean, playing for Dundee. He's not great, is he? I mean, the options today don't look... I'm going to go... I feel like we should go with Hoyt, to be honest. This guy, Liam Hogan, looks pretty good. Plays for Salford. Maybe we'll go for him. He's been playing quite well this season for them as well. But that part of me does want to go with the guy <laughs> from Trinidad and Tobago just because I couldn't say Trinidad... Well, Trimbag, Tri, Trimbagonian. Why is that difficult? It's not difficult is the answer. Right, welcome to the club, Mr. Gavin Hoyt. You are in the van. You're part of the team. We've got to get you in the starting eleven for today's game. You're going to be a centre-back alongside Santa's little helper and Danny Alves. I'll be honest... He's probably not that big of an improvement on what we've already got, but we're going to try and make something happen with Mr. Gavin Hoyt here. Trimbagonian. I mean, it's not difficult, is it? I, I don't know. Right, let's move on. We're playing HJK today. They're very good, I believe. I, I'm not going to claim to be an expert in uh, Finnish football, but they won the league a lot of years in a row. They've actually had a bit of an off spell. They've got Wellington here. I mean, he's pretty good, isn't he? Let's be honest. He's. Have they just signed him? I assume they have. I mean, he's probably... As, I mean, how does he compare to our player, Santa Claus? He's a bit better. Let's be honest. He's a bit better. Right. So, anyway, we're going to take on HJK today. Away from home. Going to be tricky. Obviously, Mr. Hoyt making his debut. He's not very much fit. I've already I've already done with Santa's little helper the thing of saying I can't make the player match fit. Hopefully, with 62... I mean, we probably are going to have to take him off or he's going to get injured at some point. But the rule is I have to start players who we, we bring in on that day. So it could get to a point where we have a really strong team and I don't get a lot of money to spend and I end up having to have a really bad player. I would like to know, do you think I, do you think I should add kind of good condition back to the players who I sign if they've like got bad match fitness? Let me know. Uh, I don't want to do it this time, but I don't know. It could prove a bit of a problem otherwise. So I'll leave it up to you in the comments section to let me know. Of course, we do need a nickname for Hoyt as well. I, I'm thinking there is probably some pun to do with Trinidad and Tobago in there that you can make Christmassy. I don't want Trinidad and... Well, Wellington scored. Wellington... I mean, he's quite good. Let's be honest. We're down to ninth. That Suddenly, that doesn't look too great out of a league of 13 teams. And that was three minutes in. 
I mean, they are one of the better teams, but I would have liked to have held on for a little bit longer. Not the best defending. I was about to say, like, I'm sure with Trinidad and Tobago, there are, there are some kind of some puns in there. Trinidad and Toboggan. Someone will come up with something, I'm sure. But anyway, we've 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 not conceded again after another 10 minutes, so that's a good sign. You know, we just conceded one immediately. You know how it is. I'm a little bit concerned about the 55% condition. I'll be honest. What's his natural fitness and stamina like? I'm I'm curious. 12 natural fitness, 10 stamina. We're playing him at centre back, and he's rubbish in the air. I've just noticed. He looks exhausted, and we should be signalling him to come off. Nah, we can't take him off. Not until half time. Slacer. Can we do it? And Van Grinch. Oh my gosh, you thought it was going to be an Van Grinch special, didn't you? Went wide of the mark, unfortunately. We've actually been okay this game. HJK are very good. I feel like maybe we should try and take the game to them. Should we just go attacking? I mean, we're a goal down. We need another goal. Let's, let's go for it. We've got the attacking talent. I feel like relying on our defence is our mistake. And now, oh no, Slacer's injured, right? Get in, Poilio. Poilio, get, get on. This might be a good situation to bring Reindeer in. Mr. Reindeer himself, yo-ho-ho. -ho. Let's get him in the midfield. He can charge some people down. He is now our enforcer. Is Slacer out, who is our defensive rock in the middle? Suddenly the reindeer, the deer. He needs he needs to be good for us. I don't what do reindeers do? Answers on a answers on a Christmas card. I don't know. I don't know. Show me something else. We're one nil down. I mean it's kind of respectable at the moment. I'd like some improvement though, really. That would be ideal. Let's see uh, what we can do here. Trying to well, close them down if we can. Can we can we, can we do that? Can we? There we go. Alves with his mohawk. We forgot to take off Hoyt as well. We should we should give him a rest. So we'll bring in Siepi. I mean, how does Siepi compare to Hoyt? I am curious. Okay, Hoyt is significantly better. I'll be honest. Maybe I'm overestimating the quality of our Finnish players. But um, well, Siepi alongside Santa's little helper, they're going to be the rocks in the centre of our defence today. Hopefully they can perform well. They've taken off Tanaka. I mean, he's got a fa I feel like the hallmark of quality is if a player has a face in my face pack, they must be of, they must be good, basically, compared to our players where most of the players don't. Anyway, Evangarinch trying to find some space here. Crosses it into Santa Claus. Can he score to Kazola? Who smashes it wide. Definitely should have scored. Def I mean, you can't even argue any other way. Oh, no, this could be bad. I don't trust the defence still. Siepi, what are you doing? Maybe we should have kept Hoyt on. I mean, given Slay Slay saved us. He's given us another chance there. I think that's what we can say. He's definitely given us another chance. Right, an hour gone. I want to be like, oh, what tactical changes can we make? Because it's only day five, there aren't actually that many tactical changes that I can make here. The, the options are kind of limited, especially because we've been getting lots of low-value kind of transfers from the wheel so far. 1-0 down here, 10 minutes left. I'm trying to think what good players we could have had with the letter H. We could have had Henderson. I'm trying to think of other players with the letter H. It's more difficult on the spot than I realised. Right, we should probably go overload, although it might be a little late now. Let's bring on Hakala. I mean, look at Santi Cazorla on a 6.1. Literally the worst performer in an amateur finish team is Santi Cazorla. I mean, I don't want to call him out. I know he's been injured a lot in real life. But clearly Finland isn't where you're meant to be, my friend. You're just not very good. Anyway, three minutes of added time. We're not getting a goal. We're going to lose. We've kept on a little drawing run. We've been unbeaten up until this point. It's taken a few days for us to finally take our first defeat. HJK, they are pretty good. I feel like Wellington is kind of an indicator of how good their team is. And unfortunately, it wasn't our day. 1-0 at Fish. Away from home, it's, it's not bad. It's not great. Where are we? We're actually in seventh, but we have played more games than a fair few teams behind us, which isn't great, to be honest. So we need to bounce back tomorrow. Anyway, guys, hopefully you did enjoy today's video. Apologies that it's up a little bit later than I'd like. Again, I'm still trying to catch up with my own backlog, coming in after work every day and recording these. It's a little bit of a pickle. I'd like to do a double day one day, but today's not that day, I don't think. Tomorrow is Finland's 100th birthday, I learned. So if you've got any ideas for something special we could do for tomorrow's episode, maybe... We sign only a Finnish player and we just spin the wheel and then sign a Finnish player worth that money who plays outside of this league or something like that. Let me know. You know, it's not often that our 100th birthday comes around for a country and seeing as we are in Finland, 
it feels rude not to do anything to mark the occasion. But anyway, hopefully I do see you guys tomorrow for day six of the Advent Calendar Challenge. If you have enjoyed, of course, leave a like on the series. Let me know you're enjoying it. We do need nickname suggestions, so leave them down in the comments below uh, for Hoyt. And other than that, it is me, Jack, and I will talk to you guys in a bit. I'm out.